around the world. We are going in. Let's go. There's a hidden army of workers. Things can go wrong really, really fast. Who, in the face of danger and turbulent times, work in all weathers, day and night, to deliver no matter what. Stop, number two. Stop, stop. Step into the $6 trillion world of heavy logistics. Hey! Meet the people for whom no load is too heavy. Anything up in the air, it wants to come down. No item too big. It's the case of demolition, destruction, and make it happen. And no route too difficult. The more that I get off, the less stress that I have. An industry dedicated to one common goal. Keep it going, mate. Keep it coming. Keeping the planet moving by land, air, and sea. Meet the Mega Shippers. This time on Mega Shippers. In one of China's biggest docks, six massive specialist container cranes are destined for the shipping port of Miami, 18,500 kilometers away, with just three days for loading. This project really came to life really about two years ago. Uh, is when we started getting the first glimpse of, hey, we actually are going to be moving forward with the project. The technical challenge of loading six brand new 25 meter high RTGs on the deck of AAL Newcastle for an 18,500 kilometer voyage from Shanghai to Miami will test the shipping company and the vessel to their limits. 25 meters long, 25 meters high, and 15 meters wide. Each one weighs in at 135 tons. But before the RTGs can be loaded, the Newcastle's cranes must first fill the cargo holds with other cargo, loaded on the same sailing to make full use of her cargo capacity. These vessels can carry probably 99% of all cargoes, uh, general cargoes that are available in the world. And we wanted it to trade worldwide at every port. There's no restriction on these vessels, they can work anywhere for any cargoes. Uh, quite a uh, big uh, piece and uh, it's uh, very difficult uh, to maneuver uh, such a cargo and you can see now it's also uh, windy. This cargo is uh, very big in dimension and it took about 2,000 hours of planning. In order to put these two on board, we need these two gantries to move forward. AAL Newcastle and her multi-million, 25-metre-tall cargo heads for the Pacific Ocean and her 18,500-kilometre voyage to Miami, Florida. It's going to be a slow process, but it, uh, it should go very well. The recently docked AAL Newcastle is loaded with six 155-tonne rubber-tired gantry cranes. I want this in the air and on the ground really bad really bad. One moves one way, the other one moves the other way. It gets very, very uncomfortable very quickly. It's about showtime. but there's less than an hour to complete the job. Determined to work a miracle in Miami, Christian coordinates the final lift. And eventually, the clock can be stopped. Having the empty deck, it feels great. I mean, we have, uh, you know, and it's uh, basically the job's complete. With the RTGs running on electric and paving a way for a greener future for the shipping industry as a whole.